Whether you have a dog that has a crazy digging problem or you're just wanting to be proactive, this little video clip will start you on your way to eliminating your dog's digging behavior. A dog that likes to dig can be one of the most challenging behaviors to eliminate. However, you can correct this behavior rather quickly by taking the necessary steps. As a dog owner, do not become discouraged even when their digging becomes very trying, especially when they destroy properties such as gardens and flower beds. Dog digging is an unwanted behavior and it needs to be corrected, but at no point should there be behavior be construed as retaliation towards you, even when your dog digs in multiple locations. Think about it. It's not like your dog is sitting there trying to devise a plan on how to punish you for coming home late or the fact that you forgot to feed him the night before. Yeah, like your dog's actually sitting there going, <laughs> Yeah, I'll show my master what a jerk he is by digging an escape tunnel to China. <laughs> Better yet, I think I'm just going to rearrange the flowers in the garden. That's right. I'm the top dog around here, biatch. As I mentioned, your dog has an unwanted behavior, but be very practical on how you go about correcting the problem. Don't be the type of pet owner who physically punishes their dog, thinking that he's going to understand why you are punishing him. Pet owners who act on physical punishment often make mistaken thinking their dog knows what he or she has done by cowering or just running away. Yeah, your dog's just freaking scared of you. Hello? If this is you, I hope your dog does dig a hole underneath the fence and just runs away. Dog digging is very frustrating to say the least, especially when it comes to a daily occurrence. When your dog's digging becomes a problem, you may be asking or telling yourself, why are you digging? That's it, you're going to the pound buster. Why do you hate me so much? Or perhaps you just have the big question mark in the back of your head marked, why? Why? Why in the world does my dog dig so much? Most likely, you will not have to scratch the surface too hard to figure out what the cause is. Either way, it's time to put your detective hat on and go to work. Be proactive in your dog's environment to find out what may cause him or her to dig. Typically, this behavior tends to focus on triggers which can be boredom, isolation, another animal in the area, or just trying to escape. Whatever the cause is, it's up to you, the pet owner, to become more vigilant and even catch your dog in the act. Walk around your yard and look for obvious clues into why your dog chose their location to dig. Are the holes sporadic? Is there something actually buried there? And dogs have a keen sense of smell, they can find utility cables that were not buried to the correct depth, and it's enough to pique your dog's curiosity. Look around. Do the locations have any pattern to them? Are the holes around the fence line or just random? Unfortunately, there is no silver bullet that will eliminate this behavior until you investigate the problem. Stopping a dog from digging is achievable, but you will have to observe your dog in their environment to determine what triggers this behavior and apply techniques to discourage them. If you find your dog's digging to be prompted by boredom, giving your dog an adequate amount of toys to play with can reduce their tendency to dig. Walking your dog is another great form of exercise to release the built-up energy your dog may have instead of him or her trying to dig for oil in your backyard. If you find your dog's digging to be prompted by people, you can properly socialize your dog by taking them to a dog park, which is an easy fix. When taking your dog to a park, do not just focus on socializing with other dogs when the same technique can be applied to humans too. Proper people socialization will show your dog that strangers are in fact okay and will reduce their tendencies to want to dig out of the yard to investigate humans that may be nearby. And keep in mind, a tired dog is not one that likes to dig. Dog digging is one of many unwanted behavioral problems that come into play when trying to train your dog. Make no mistake, dogs and puppies will often trade one behavioral problem for another and that is why you will want to gain more knowledge in the dog training field so you can handle each one appropriately. So hang around or check back with us or better yet sign up for our free informative newsletter as we constantly provide free information on tips on dog training techniques at dogtrainingwizard.net